Hello, amazing friends. All right, so this is Elizabeth. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to share with you our tour of our deluxe studio. No, wait, one bedroom at Boardwalk. <laughs> we booked a studio this trip for our Run Disney at Boardwalk, and we are doing the 5K at Epcot. We're very excited about it, and I thought this would be great to be staying at an Epcot resort um, for the Run Disney, because that's where we'll, be, where we will be running, my husband, my son, and I, and I just thought it would be really nice. So we decided to book a studio, which is half the points of a one bedroom, and Disney magic came through, and we got here, and um, we walked in, and it's a one bedroom. What a wonderful surprise. I don't think I've ever had that happen. Um, I might have, but maybe I'm blocking it out. I don't know, but it's so special, so, so special. It is huge, we have all this space. I can't wait to share with you guys. our one bedroom at Disney's Boardwalk. All right, we have a closet as soon as you walk in on the left and it has a vacuum, some of our suitcases and it looks like there's extra pillows and blankets in there. We have a mirror, hi guys. And hooks, so helpful when Disney puts hooks in. When I had little kids, my kids are now a little older, but it's such a great place to put their jackets and their bags and their stuff, which it's still good. So like right here, so good for the Disney bags. And the shelf up there is definitely useless because you're not gonna see anything up there. All right, so when you walk in, this stu or, um, one bedroom is so spacious. So you have a table and chairs for breakfast. It's our dumping ground. It's where we put our bags when we first walk in. We literally just walked in. We have a reservation soon, so the kids are at the pool. So I said, drop your stuff and go really fast. So they went to the pool and I'm filming the video and I'm gonna finish unpacking. Okay, chandelier there, big mirror, makes it feel spacious. You have a couch that pulls out to a bed and then that uh, chest right here has storage in it. And then I'm just gonna pan over here. I think ours is for um, those that are physically disabled. Uh, because things are a little bit lower, like the microwave isn't up high, and then the shower is like an open roll-in shower. So I think that's what this room is. This is 5068. It's also the first room right off the elevators. Um, when you come off the elevators and turn the corner, it's right there, which is really nice. You don't have to walk very far. Uh, we have a dishwasher. We have trash. And then we've unpacked our snacks. We usually don't pack meals, so this whole kitchen, I feel, it's like kind of wasted. Sometimes we bring toast and coffee, but we're planning on enjoying um, Epcot and Studios because both of those are walking distance from here. Um, but we will use the cups and these are our typical snacks I pack for the kids mostly. Cereal, chips, goldfish, meat sticks, all the things, cookies, powdered stuff to make fun drinks uh, for everybody. Uh, okay, so we have a stove, toaster, everything you need to use the stove and coffee maker, all the things. We have a freezer, fridge, and then over here, they have the Disney TV playing for us, lots of drawers and a DVD player, which is really nice. Now, what's frustrating about these one bedrooms is they don't sleep five, they sleep four. So some of the DVC resorts we've stayed in, this pulls out to a bed, and my son was very excited for that for the studio. And we brought the air mattress because he doesn't like sharing a bed with his sister. I understand. I didn't like sharing with my sibling either. Um, so he'll be sleeping on the floor instead of on that really cool bed underneath there. But I'm grateful for all the space. Okay, let's work our way over here. We have one of my favorite things about this one bedroom is a washer dryer. Throw in all your clothes when you get home. You don't have any dirty clothes to put away. It's amazing. In the bathroom, we have a sink. We have a mirror, we have a toilet, and then that shower I was telling you about, if I turn on the light, the fan's gonna go. So it's like a roll-in shower. We've been here before where it's like a glass shower. That's why I was thinking this room is definitely uh, for those that need it to, to roll in. All right, so there is a jetted tub. It's glorious at the end of the day. We're doing Run Disney this trip, so I'm definitely looking forward to that. We got Disney toiletries. Some of the Disney hotels, they're doing the like pumps in the wall. 
this hasn't been upgraded yet. So we don't have those. We have the individuals. And I like the individuals. Comment down below which one you like. I like those individuals because we could take them home and relive our vacation. I love this vanity. So if you saw, there's a mirror and sink in the bathroom over there, but then there's also one here. So this is where I get to get ready and I get to just spread out and have all that space. You have a door to that bathroom. And then in here is a giant walk-in closet. I feel like this is such wasted space <laughs> because honestly, we don't need that much space. Even if we're here for a week, we don't need that much space. <laughs> Um, so here we are. So here's the tub and what's really cool. And I've done this every time I've come here, even when I was a kid is you get in the tub and then this opens up. You can see outside, but in the tub, you can watch TV. <laughs> so that's what I do. I watch Mickey cartoons while taking a tub and it's amazing. All right. So you have a bench here with storage underneath it. You have a full length mirror, which is so great for those Disney outfits. We have three drawers and an open shelf, which is great. And then on top, which you can see is the dumping ground. I've got to unpack. We have a chair over here, a lamp, another lamp, another lamp. There are plugs and two USBs on this side as well as that side. And this room, I mentioned it's right off the elevator, which is so nice because this is a big resort. So sometimes when you get off the elevator, your room could be miles and miles. Not this one, it's really close. However, if you're looking for a quiet room, this is not it. It's not overlooking the gardens. This is a garden or pool view room, and they put us overlooking the main pool. So right now they're doing Disney trivia. It's very loud out there. I can kind of hear it with the door closed. So if you have little ones, um, you're going to hear this. And then also if the pools are open late at night, you're going to hear. I don't mind it this trip. We're going to be go, go, go with the run Disney. But you get to see the Swan, the Swan and Dolphin Hotel. It's really pretty here. And then the Leaping Horse Libations, if I'm saying it right, that's the like pool bar where they have food. That's right there too. That's what that is. And then you can see the slide. Such a gorgeous room. Such a great space. All right, if you like these videos, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not subscribed to see more videos like this one. I'll definitely be sharing Run Disney soon and then um, adventures from our trip too. All right, thanks guys, bye.